Hi everyone, welcome to my practice room and today I will present you my contrabass clarinet. This is my Leblanc 340 paperclip contrabass clarinet. It's still low C and unfortunately it's out of production. You can still find them in the second-hand market because this instrument is actually from the 60s. I didn't buy this instrument new. It was completely repaired. Well, now it's in good shape and I can play it professionally. As you probably know, I'm playing a lot of contrabass clarinet. So for me, one of the most important factors why did I choose this instrument is because of portability. Among the, the different models we have in the market, this is the smallest in the sense that I can put this instrument in this case. This is a bassoon case, which before it, it had four compartments, but I opened two of them, making now two big compartments, as you might see. With this instrument we have here one part, in this side we have a bell and a detachable extension for the low C. The main body of the instrument is divided into the upper and the lower body, which when I unscrew this little screw, I can put it into two pieces. part goes to the back of the case and the upper part goes to the front. Then with this case it came this for accessories for bassoon which I use to put my neck and for the bell I did also a bit of DIY and I did these little things where I can safely put my other parts of the instrument like this, this is protected and now I just, because here there is a lot of room I put here the extension I also put here the bell and then I put here the neck and then it closes and you might ask what about the mouthpiece? off we go this instrument it's easy to travel but it's also easy to go around in the backstage. So when I'm playing a concert, this instrument actually I can hold it with one hand and I can actually take it to the, to the stage and run around with it and it's actually practical to use it. A lot of you have asked me how do I play seated and how do I play standing. When I play seated I have two solutions. The easier one is a small pin in an L shape that I insert in the clarinet and then I just put it on the chair so when I play on a chair seated I can use it like that besides this very easy solution I have two longer pegs the thinner one is to play uh, sitting as I will show you well this is actually a, a very basic just a piece of metal which here it's the diameter that we can put on the clarinet and then here it's thicker because when I used uh, a thinner piece of metal uh, actually this was very unstable so I decided to have this one built uh, which here it's much thicker and so when I use this uh, the instrument is just much more stable which gives me a much more precise way of playing While this L-shaped peg is very easy to use when you just need to play for a, a few bars or when you want to walk around with an instrument, if you want to play for very long, if you want to play a whole opera, maybe it's not the, the best solution. That's when I use this longer peg. When I do solo recitals or chamber music concerts, sometimes I want to play standing. And for that, I have tried different solutions. The last solution I found is actually combining this peg that I use to play uh, seated with uh, another peg. I remove this rubber foot and I just 
slide in this longer peg. This makes a very long peg which I can adjust the, the height so it makes it easy to play while standing. I didn't buy it in a music shop. This was specifically made for me and I just went to a metal shop and asked if they could do it. If you want to try something like that, just find yourself a metal shop, give them which measures you want and just build one for you. It's very easy and practical. So, this is my contrabass clarinet. It's very portable and it's easy to play. Fits my needs and that's why I'm very happy to keep playing on it and keep using it in concerts, rehearsals and in my freelancing career. I hope you can also find a solution that fits all your needs. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you found some information that was helpful and well, see you next video. So this is my contraband and that's how why almost and that will make you not a very good example probably this is my baby and as I told you I will leave <laughs>